Two high-ranking officers left without a job. This comes after a strange removal from the force. News Center 23's Derek Garcia is following the officers' legal fight with the city, their former chief, and now the department's top official. It's very unfortunate for me and my family. I'm, I'm fighting for everyone in the department. The tale of two high-ranking officers ends with one very unhappy ending. To my understanding, it's not normal. Lieutenant Kirk Massey and Sergeant Luis Nino are out of jobs. And according to their attorney, the two have likely been dishonorably discharged from the Brownsville Police Department, making future work in law enforcement highly unlikely. Four, attorney Craig Dietz with CLEAT, the Combined Law Enforcement Associations five. of Texas, is representing the fired officers in a federal lawsuit. They're accusing the city of Brownsville, recently retired Chief of Police Orlando Rodriguez, and Commander David Dale of violating the officers' First Amendment rights. Massey is the vice president of CLEAT, Nino, the president of the Brownsville Police Officers Association. How would you describe the relationship between CLEAT, the Brownsville Police Officers Association, and the Brownsville Police Department? Well, I think the only word to use right now is strained. It's very strained. Strained and strange. Strange because in two videos produced by CLEAT, the officers are said to be placed under house arrest for 180 days and the subjects of internal investigations. BPD says Nino violated an order by allowing an officer to use a personal camera at a potential crime scene. BPD feared the use of personal cameras in the department could lead to loss of evidence. The reason for Massey's investigation, according to Cleet, is confusing. Commander Dale apparently filed a complaint against Lieutenant Massey, alleging that he misrepresented uh, Dale's instructions to him in the conversation they had on June 29. According to the lawsuit, Commander Dale accused Lieutenant Massey of ordering officers to, quote, submit communications to Dale concerning the personal equipment issue, end quote. Commander Dale accused Massey of turning officers against him. And if this happens to me and it can happen to a sergeant that's been there for 10 years, then this can happen to anybody in the department. That was Derek Garcia reporting. On top of the lawsuit, both officers are appealing their termination. Chief Rodriguez announced his retirement this week, and the new acting chief is Commander David Dale. Brownsville police denied our request for an interview.